Brushy Mountain Penitentiary wasn't just a jail, it was also a coal mine for the state of Tennessee and known as the Gates to Hell. The prison lease system had been adopted throughout the South as the government couldn't afford to feed and house their prisoners and a convict lease system brought in money. While there was never a death row at Brushy, there were indeed many deaths. The original wooden structure was in poor shape and by the 1930s it was housing over 900 men which was roughly 300 more than its capacity. So plans were made to build the structure that we see today. Convicts broke sandstone from the nearby quarry and the new building was built in the shape of a Greek cross. Brushy was now safer and more sanitary, but prisoners were still working the mines under horrible conditions. Classified in 1969 as a maximum security prison, it was seen as the last stop. In 1957, they closed down the hole, a below-level set of cells where prisoners were kept in horrific conditions in the dark and solitude, and built D-Block to house the worst inmates. D-Block was built on the site of the old death house, where bodies were stored until burial. In 1989, a new high-security annex was built, and D-Blocks was downgraded to minimum security. Brushy was home to several infamous inmates, among them James Earl Ray, the killer of Dr. Martin Luther King, who managed to escape Brushy Mountain only to be captured and returned. Paul Dennis Reed, the fast food killer, was also imprisoned at Brushy, now serving as a landmark piece of history with a distillery bringing new life to the location. Brushy sits nestled in the mountains, a remarkable sight to behold and a keeper of stories waiting to be told. Please join me as I venture down into the hall of Brushy Mountain alone. You see that? Now you're able to light that up. Well done. Could you do that again? If you're okay with me visiting with you, could you do that again? in here just before I started filming. Let's see if we can find them again. Are you here with me? Are you here with me? My name is Debbie. And I just want to spend some time in here with you. Spend some time in here with you. Where did you go? Are you hiding from me? I know you're in here somewhere. Can't be hiding very far because something that's tiny. I'm sorry that you were locked in here. I don't know what you did to deserve being locked in this tiny little cell. And it looks like there was two of you in here too. Way too small for one person, let alone two. Alright, let's see if I can finagle my way around. Uh oh. That's the last It's playing up. Could you try? Do you want me to leave? Why are you in here? What did you do? Who drew these? The house. These things on the wall. I don't think my camera is filming very well. There we go. Sorry, guys. Oh my gosh. I didn't even have the night vision on. What kind of an idiot am I? I'm off my game a little bit. You see if you can touch this? See if you can line it up for me. Switch it off. 
You see how that lights up? See if you could, if you could do that. Can you light it up to red? If you're a gentleman, would you light it up to red? I mean, when we were in here earlier, guys, it was like so crazy. What's going on and now? It's just nothing. How many weeks were you in here? Is there anything you'd like to say to me? Is there anybody even in here? several drawings of houses on this wall and then that's kind of sad in a way I guess Lee hello we're just hanging out in the corner yes we are talking if I give you a little box over there. Do you want to touch it for me? See if you can touch this box.
Good job. I hope it's not hurting you. Can you do that again? Go on, do it again. Dance. Dance? <laughs> I'm not going to dance for you. You dance for me. You dance for me. I'm not your cheeky D. <laughs> well, dance with you. Maybe, if you would like. What would you like to dance to? You're totally avoiding that, I can see. <laughs> Pulled you like right out of the way. <laughs> How about, let's try this one. Try this one. Could you light that one up again? Either of them? Melissa. Melissa. Is she your wife or your girlfriend? My name is Debbie. Could you, if you want me to leave, could you touch one of those little boxes? You're totally pulling your feet away from them. I can see that. I'm not going to stay for much longer. I'm almost ready to leave. I do thank you for coming and talking to me. Or at least watching me. <laughs> Could you wave goodbye to me? Because I'll be leaving soon. Hand. Hand. Okay, is your hand touching the device? Or you want my hand? Would you like to touch my hand? We can try that. Let me see if I can do this. Does one of you want to touch my hand? Just don't hurt me, okay? I'm a friend. Does one of you want to touch my hand? Just don't hurt me, okay? I'm a friend. I'm trying to reach you. Can one of you reach out? You died? I know, I'm sorry. Did you die here? Did you die in this cell? Guys, my alarm will go off in a little while. 
Sorry if it makes you jump. Mary. Mary. Is that your wife too? One of your wives? Yes. Well, have you seen her? Did she come to visit you? I don't know what you do after you pass. Are you able to travel? Or are you trapped here? Is Mary able to come and visit you? Buried here? Are you buried here? How many of you are here? What about the other device, the other little thing on the floor? Can you make that light up again? Can you do the other one too? Try and do both of them. Try Sacrifice. To no. Sacrifice what? What would you sacrifice? What would you sacrifice? Are there any bad spirits here? Alright. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Okay, well I did ask if there was a bad spirit. I'm glad this the Holy Spirit is with you. So, if you believe in God and the Holy Spirit, then you know that God will forgive you. He forgives everything and he wants all his children to go home. You're not trapped here, okay? Sorry guys, I put my camera down <laughs> and I totally got distracted and didn't think to pick it back up. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, well, it's time for me to finish. So let me know guys if you see anything or hear anything that I've missed. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment and subscribe if you haven't already and please consider becoming a member to support the channel and get early access to videos and exclusive content.